welcome back. Today I'm going to be tackling a 1966 Chevrolet Impala convertible in case you didn't already get that from the thumbnail or the title. I will be adding some flake and patterns and some much needed pop above the midline trim because that's what the owner wants. Um, as you'll see, we did it more subtle in the beginning. It's just simple pinstriping, real clean, real subtle, still looks good, but we're ready for more pop now. So that's what I'll be doing. That's it for me. Just a quick intro. Thank you for being here to watch this video and let's get after it. Okay, one thing I want to point out real quick about masking this car up is how I approach the panels. As you'll see, I have the first tape leading up to the blue pinstripe, and then I lay this green fine line over the blue pinstripe. So I paint the silver and the flake, peel the green fine line to expose the blue pinstripe, and then I clear over all of that, creating more of a staircase instead of a cliff down to the main body color, which will make it easier to sand out on this round and then even easier to sand out after I do the graphics and the final clear. I use masking tape of different widths to mark out my spacing and I do that because it's quick and easy to do from side to side but one thing you run into is you got to be very aware of the shape and the smoothness of your fine lines because you can very easily come out with a real choppy shape with just a straight line between each tape mark and you just can't be doing that so something to look out for if you're doing this kind of work. <laughs> 